Hello Celtics fans, welcome to Boston Celtics News today. Before we dive into today's exclusive update, make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications so you never miss out on the latest Celtics news. You might think that winning an NBA championship, being named NBA Finals MVP, and signing one of the richest contracts in NBA history might be enough for Boston Celtics forward Jalen Brown, but that wasn't the case. When news broke that Brown was being left off Team USA in favor of his teammate Derek White after Kawhi Leonard was asked to be asked to leave the team ahead of the 2024 Summer Olympics, Brown was openly critical of the move. Lifetime Celtics fan and podcast host Bill Simmons also weighed in, criticizing Brown for his comments. Simmons pointed out how unrest in team chemistry following a championship can lead to a team falling flat the next season. Although Brown later congratulated White for making the team, his initial public reaction was to complain that Nike's affiliation with Team USA led to his exclusion. Brown has been vocal about his criticism of Nike's business practices in the past. Notably, Brown was not only the NBA Finals MVP for the Celtics in 2024 after defeating the Dallas Mavericks, but he was also the Eastern Conference Finals MVP. He signed a five-year, $285 million contract extension with the Celtics in July 2023. They're trying to do all these different things with Team USA. And White made more sense for it, Simmons said, on the Bill Simmons podcast on July 21st. So if Brown is going to express his displeasure, if he's going to blame Nike or whatever, he has to do it through the prism of Derek White's an awesome player and he was a great choice. It's upsetting to me that I wasn't given a chance to compete for one of the forward spots. Some way to frame it that doesn't make it seem like you're diff on your teammate because he got picked over you. That's not the kind of stuff that was happening before they won the title. Simmons highlighted several examples from NBA history to support his point about how discontent behind the scenes can derail a team's championship repeat hopes. Most notably, he referenced the Golden State Warriors after they won the 2022 NBA Finals. At the beginning of the following season, video leaked of a Warriors practice in which forward Draymond Green punched guard Jordan Poole. That season, the Warriors lost in the Western Conference semifinals, and both Green and head coach Steve Kerr admitted that the quest to repeat as champions was essentially over after the punch. There's no hiding from it. The incident with Draymond and Jordan at the beginning of the year played a role in that, Kerr said. It's hard for that not to impact a team. One thing Brown didn't seem to understand was that White will likely have a specialized role on Team USA. One that might see him register a DNP when it comes to Olympic play. With Brown, it would have upset the chemistry on a team that's already full of forwards, including his own teammate, Jason Tatum. Even though Jalen's right, and he should be one of the 12 guys on this team, if we were just picking a team of the 12 best guys. If we were just picking a team of the 12 best guys, Simmons said. He should be on the team if we're doing that, but that's not what the team was. So, Celtics fans, what do you think about Jalen Brown's situation? Share your thoughts in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe to Boston Celtics News today for more updates. Go Celtics!